for someone who drinks coffee, sits in his or her kitchen, say, and looks out the window and sees this migratory bird out there and thinks, well, maybe that bird was on a coffee farm that produced the coffee I'm drinking right here. For a lot of people, that's a really strong emotional connection. Coffee is grown in these, what are called biodiversity hotspots. Coffee evolutionarily is an understory crop. And so it's evolved to do well in the shade. When you take the shade away from a coffee farm, you're changing it from something that looks very much like a forest to something that looks like, my best description is English hedgerows. But in terms of habitat for forest songbirds, it really doesn't offer very much. So what you do is you change the landscape and birds that would normally be using that habitat, they no longer have that habitat. If we're looking at a shade coffee plantation, in simplest terms, it's gonna look very much like a forest. You're gonna have a level of shade trees that the farmer manages. It's gonna form a canopy of 10, 12, 14 meters tall. Under that, um, the farmer may well have things like fruit trees, like uh, oranges, or avocados, persimmons, of course, bananas. Um, and then over that, the farmer may allow to grow what we call emergent species that come out way taller and what they then form is this structural diversity and it's this structural diversity that is very highly correlated with bird species diversity. So what we have is these migratory birds going back and forth every year. Farmers in Latin America producing coffee and consumers in North America drinking it. So you got two cultures sort of joined by these organisms that, you know, have evolved the system of going back and forth every, every year. Bird-friendly coffee means that it is a coffee grown on land that creates habitat for birds, viable quality habitat. One, it's organic. Two, it looks like a forest and it meets certain criteria that we've developed. It came right out of research based on science and we have taken it to the marketplace.